Welcome to our tutorial about the sentiment analysis feature for tweets, which is available since version 20.4. Sentiment analysis is a tool for quickly determining emotions of textual data by investigating linguistic features of a text. This can be helpful to categorize a large amount of unstructured data based on its sentiment, which can be either positive, negative or neutral. This is done by evaluating the words contained within a piece of text with respect to the polarity of single expressions. With the new MaxQDA 2024 update, you can instantly perform a sentiment analysis for your Twitter data and even autocode the sentiments to keep track and to capture shifts of emotion within your data. To make sure that your MaxQDA version is up to date, click on the question mark at the top right and select search for updates. To analyze the sentiments of your tweets, you have to go to the Analysis tab and select Analyze Tweets. The sentiment analysis shows up in the form of two buttons right here at the top. The first one allows us to analyze sentiments, which MaxQDA does automatically. MaxQDA will now add four columns. The first one shows the sentiment while the two columns following represent the number of words with either a positive or negative polarity. The last column simply show the difference between the two. On the left side, you'll notice some checkboxes which allow to filter your tweets based on their sentiment. To save those filters for later use in MaxQDA, you can use the autocode tweets with sentiment function to automatically code them with their sentiments. You can then retrieve them like any other code. 